It was a drawn out dysfunctional Multnomah County Board meeting today. The long awaited ambulance staffing resolution has failed after a long meeting. Even the commissioner who originally argued for this resolution ended up voting against it. Thanks for joining us at 11. I'm Elizabeth Din. I'm Jeff Gianola and today's dysfunctional meeting leaves county residents still facing slow ambulance response times when lives are at stake. Let's bring in Ariel Yakabazi. Ariel, you were there for the last bit of this meeting that went on for hours today. Yeah, hey guys, that meeting, it was certainly a long one. It lasted from 9 a.m. until about 5 in the afternoon. So as you said, very drawn out. Now, Commissioner Sharon Myron is the one who pushed for a resolution that would essentially push Chair Vega Peterson to change some staffing when it comes to ambulances and would eventually help with ambulance response times. But that resolution ended up getting pushed down. The resolution fails. A resolution hoping to get more ambulances out on the streets of Multnomah County fails. Having this outdated, unnecessary requirement that there be two paramedics staffing ambulances means we have half the number of ambulances that could be on the street. She wanted to temporarily change the ambulance staffing from requiring two paramedics per ambulance to one paramedic and one EMT. I asked Chair Jessica Vega Peterson after today's meeting why discussions were pushed until now. I think we brought it back and we were able to have more of a full discussion and had folks in the panel who were coming. During today's lengthy and heated discussion, Commissioner Myron brought her resolution to light again. Most public commenters hoping for the same thing, more help on the streets. For me, it was simple. It, it basically said, we are saying we encourage the chair to allow the change in ambulance staffing. It could not be simpler. That's when Commissioner Beeson pushed to amend the resolution, indicating the chair is in mediation and that the board wait for that mediation to wrap up. For me, we are um, we are finalizing mediation that we've been in with AMR to find a um, agreed upon resolution to our crisis in um, ambulance. Commissioner Julia Brim Edwards also hoping to amend the resolution, asking for more accountability over EMS leadership and more transparency to the board. Myron then tried to amend Beeson's amendment, but did not get enough votes. As a result, Myron voted no on her own resolution. I don't know where the concept of saving lives gets lost. Yeah, so here's what we can look forward to next Thursday at the Multnomah County Board meeting then. So Chair Jessica Vager Peterson says she'll wrap up mediation with AMR between now and then and will share more details about their solution next week. And that includes hearing from county health officials and local EMTs. Reporting live in Portland tonight, Ariel Yakabazi, Coin 6 News.